Mojo and the Grand Picnic In the heart of a wondrous forest, nestled among the towering mountains, lived Mojo the bear and his dearest friend, five-year-old Princess Penelope. Mojo was a gentle giant with soft brown fur, and Penelope was a lively and adventurous princess. One sunny spring morning, the forest was buzzing with life. Trees were adorned with blossoms, and the forest floor was covered in fresh, colourful fruits and nuts. Penelope had an idea that made her eyes sparkle with excitement. Mojo, she exclaimed, let's have a grand picnic for all our forest friends. The fruits and nuts are ripe and abundant, and the forest is the perfect place for a springtime feast. Mojo's heart warmed at the thought of a picnic, and he nodded enthusiastically. Together, they set off to collect the finest forest fare for their feast. As they explored the forest, Penelope and Mojo gathered apples, plums and walnuts, filling their baskets to the brim. The forest animals watched with curiosity as the two friends collected the delicious treats. With their baskets full, Mojo and Penelope ventured deeper into the forest to find the perfect spot for their picnic. They discovered a picturesque clearing beneath the shade of the tallest trees, with a soft carpet of moss covering the ground. Penelope's creative spirit kicked in as she said, Mojo, let's make a cosy blanket out of leaves for everyone to sit on. It will be a forest-style picnic. With leaves from different trees, they crafted a beautiful blanket, and Mojo arranged the fruits and nuts in a colourful display. The forest fair looked like a natural work of art. But the picnic wouldn't be complete without games and laughter. Penelope set up a game of ring toss using branches and twigs, and Mojo organised a friendly race around the clearing for the forest creatures to enjoy. As the forest animals gathered, everyone marvelled at the feast and the playful activities. Birds, squirrels, rabbits, and even a friendly fox joined in the festivities. It was a grand celebration of spring, friendship, and the abundance of the forest. Laughter filled the air, as the animals played games and savoured the delicious forest food. Penelope and Mojo were overjoyed as they watched their forest friends come together in harmony. As the sun began to set, the animals bid farewell, their hearts full of gratitude for the wonderful day. Penelope and Mojo returned to their cosy home in the forest, knowing that the beauty of spring was not only in the blossoms and fruits, but also in the joy of sharing it with their beloved forest community. And so, in their magical forest in the mountains, Mojo the bear and Princess Penelope continued to create cherished memories and embrace the wonders of nature, knowing that the simple pleasures of a picnic with friends were among the sweetest moments of all. The End